headed into the temple. We don't know what it's called, but it's a temple. That's a demon. They worship demons here. They have two at the at the entrance. And beautiful flowers. Beautiful trees. You can hear the birds chirping. It's very peaceful in these temple grounds. You have to take off your shoes though before you go in. But we're not going in. We're just going to look around. See the snake? We only see these things here. There goes Ida. So you can see this temple is, they're pretty big places. Inside actually, they're very cool. I don't know if we can actually go inside. I think we can, but we have to find our way in. We might have to worship or something, which we don't want to do. Uh, 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 look here, it looks like a really pretty, mm, what do you call that thing? I don't know what you call that thing, but it's pretty. pictures of Buddha and pictures of all sorts of demons. I think this is like a mixture of both the Eastern and, I mean, Chinese and, and, um, and Indian Buddhism. This is where the monks live. There goes another one. They're talking to each other. <laughs> Fighting. <laughs> They're not very peaceful Buddhists. <laughs> We're just kidding. They are. And we can see up close what this stuff looks like. It's all really pretty stuff. This is a guy or a woman cleaning up. I think this is where they eat. Um, we just walked down the cross. Sorry, I lost my bearing. Wasn't sure where we were going. There are many bakery shops here. This place originally was colonized by the French, and so the French love bakeries. They love baked goods and croissants and baguettes and all these kinds of stuff. And so they think it's um, you, can, and you can hear some Lao, some Laotian. The Japanese are everywhere. Osaka, sushi. It's sushi by a Japanese. It's sushi by a Louis Ocean. We don't know what would happen. Could be bad. As you can see, it's a very quiet town. Not too much going on here. Not too many people. We're actually walking towards the river. Ida loves it. Yeah. I 
Lots of construction going on. What are you gonna do? People riding bikes. She was on a bike. Two bikes. Hmm? They're shopping. Hmm? Shopping, shopping, shopping. For rent, bicycles. You wanna rent a bike? She's at the Coco Cafe. This is Asian and Western food. That looks like a lonely place. Chemicraft, we have mulberries. World Fair Trade Organization. Oh, we have to have a beer lao. Maybe when I have dinner. Nope. Duong Duan, two. Ooh. I just was hit in the eye with my, by a fly. Bus ticket, train ticket, air arrangement. Book and pay here. Lots of travel agencies. I think most people who come here, they're just waiting to get out. Or can't <laughs> wait to get out. <laughs> Why? Just it's because nice. of all the travel. <laughs> yeah, it's a nice town for two days. <laughs> And it's time oh, to I go. Then it's time to go. <laughs> this is the Riverside Hotel under construction. It will be nice again. We almost stood here. The V Hotel. We should have stayed at the V Hotel. I think it was cheaper too. Oh, sorry. I didn't know. Oh, look, this is a very cute place. What kind of food do they have there? Via Via restaurant would be your Lao. I think we're eating there. Maybe not. I don't know. I just like the way it looks. And then here we have a Laotian woman just hanging out in our empty restaurant. Might be really good. We should check it out. Let's look at the DACA menu. I love halal. I love. Oh, look. Kinchuri. Cheese naan. Oh my goodness. Butter roti. Butter naan. Mint naan. Special naan. Banana parata. Oh my goodness. This is the good stuff. Oh, look this. Oh, let's look at street food. Street food. Check it out. Mm, yummy. We have some chicken legs there and some chicken. Yeah. Or actually, those are wings, not chicken okay. legs. And then we also have many meats on a stick. Many meats on a stick. The smorgasbord of meat on a stick. I've never seen so much meat on a stick. 